And once again, our city will be on the national stage this weekend and next. The women's NCAA tournament will be hosted in Spokane, and the annual Pacific Northwest Volleyball Qualifier will also be here, meaning we will have about 10,000 guests over the next two weekends. KXOY 4's Tori Brene live outside the convention center where the volleyball tournament will be this weekend. Tori? Yes, the volleyball teams and also the basketball teams will start to arrive tomorrow. When they arrive, they will bring with them their fans and their families, and then those people are bringing their wallets. Nothing further than Seattle. Deanna Chamberlain and her daughter have never been to Spokane before. They are here now for this weekend's Pacific Northwest Volleyball Qualifier. We are playing uh, three teams from different areas. Between this weekend and next weekend, an estimated 8,500 people will come to Spokane for the volleyball tournament, and they are all from out of town with out of town dollars. I mean, with food and everything, my guess would probably be at with hotel, probably about $1,000. Hello, ladies. The downtown Onion had its usual lunch rush today, but they are gearing up for their busiest two weeks of the year. Doubles oh, all week long, yeah. Not only are dozens of volleyball players in town, the women's NCAA tournament will also be here the next two weekends. They started making reservations for parties of anywhere from 20 to 45 back in January. Thousands of players, coaches, and fans spending the weekend in Spokane translate to $10 million spent at our restaurants, shops, and hotels. You know, and that money translates through the, you know, gets through the economy and ultimately it'll fill a pothole somewhere down the road. These two big events not only pay off in cash, but in exposure. The number one overall seed in the Spokane region. That translates to a lot of public relation exposure and the advertising equivalencies, we could never afford it. 10,000 people, many of which have never been to Spokane, some of them have never heard about it, will be here enjoying what we love about our city. Because I've heard there's some, a lot of things walking distance, the mall and the carousel, so I'm anxious to see that. It's really, it's an opportunity for us to shine as a community. And the Spokane Sports Commission says the NCAA rates our seat on everything from customer service, cleanliness, transportation, and overall friendliness. In Spokane, Tori Brunetti, KXOY4 HD News.